Oh, what's up? Right now, you guys are in a fridge. Not just any fridge, though. We got that New Air fridge, baby. So, company called New Air sent us this fridge. It's a pretty high quality unit. Does a really good job storing all of our hydration needs. There you see New Air. So yeah, I mean, it's, this is a nice fridge glass. Got our lightens it, all the good stuff, all the fixings. So, uh, just support companies that support us. They're really cool, they sent us this fridge. They saw we had a hydration crisis in the garage here. So they sent us a fridge and yeah, so we got a discount code, fill break, get 10% off your new air order. So sweet, really cool, company's helping us out. So, what are we doing in this video, Blake? This. All right, so our first order of business is going to be to get these Go Power Sports seats. We painted and mounted them in the last video, all bolted in, and man, they're gonna look super good. All right, so the seats are totally in. Now what I do is I'm just gonna bolt up all the roll cage parts. Now we're just working on the buttoning up stuff. I got all the control arms on, springs, seats, stuff like that. So, got stuff on pedals, you know, the usual. We got the aux beam lights. We got a little while ago, so let's start bolting stuff up. We have a predicament ahead of us right now. No, we don't. Well, I think I think we're deciding that it's good. Yes. But here, push down the back shock so and then good. push the front. Uh, this thing looks pretty good, guys. They put the back shocks on the front. Yeah. The thing is, though, I they, it, the suspension hardly moves at all. Either way, completely regardless of well, when the when the back springs are in the back before, there is no suspension travel. So I rather have a stupid amount of suspension travel in the back and it's stiff in the front. It's better than stiff in the front and stiff in the back, in my opinion. And you can see it's a little bit raked. I kind of like that stance though, but when you sit in it, the back will go down. So I think we're gonna leave it like this. So cool. Uh, now what we gotta do is we gotta get the engine bolted in. I actually just changed the oil in it and all that stuff, so. We're getting there, guys. All right, guys, so now we're gonna install this engine. Just kidding. No. We went and throw this beauty. Yeah, but cleaned up nice. Got our Go Power Sports header pipe on that. We painted and all that, so we'll paint her up. And just just take a moment to look at that sprocket clearance. It's a thing of beauty, to be honest. Try to get some of that. Ooh, that's pretty good, Daniel. That's pretty good. Yep. Oh, uh, we got these lights bolted up. Kind of yeah. redid the wiring. I soldered some stuff this time. Yeah, we're actually, because this is the last rendition of the cart, we're actually going to try to do it legit. Oh, and also, speaking of the backward springs, we've had a lot of comments of people telling us to fix the camber issue, and putting the rear springs on the front fixed our camber a lot. Yep. We got our build off mini bike that you'll see in the video next week. Build off of cars and cameras, red beard. Rather be welding all them. Blake's trying to crank start this thing <laughs> with the back of his arm. But yeah, we're ready to rip this thing. Here, let's see those lights, Blake. Start recording. Dang. So Jason's gonna get some chase footage.
Model 6 is pretty bad. Yeah, that's all it's really here. That's probably all the paint. Alright, so after driving this thing, uh, it turned out really well. Um, it, it's 100% solid. If the battery was fully charged, we'd have a lot more lot lifetime out of these lights, but that's not too big of a deal. Yeah, I mean, they still shine and stuff. But, so yeah, I think it's gotten our seal of approval. We've done a bunch of stuff to this thing. So, right now, what I'm gonna do, it's a sad day, we're saying goodbye to this thing, but I'm gonna put a little montage in right here of all the memories we've been through on this thing. We got it for like 150 bucks. We got the Mitsubishi running. We slammed it and then we painted it and did all this stuff to it. So it's been fun, guys. It's been fun. All right, guys, here's the new project. Uh, this thing popped up on Craigslist for 150 bucks. Hey, oh! All right, Internet Explorer is pretty good for this one. All right, guys, we just bought a Predator. Hey! Thanks for watching. This is one hell of a build. Uh, I know the montage towards the end is really cool to watch just because this thing made such a transformation. And now it's probably just gonna go to a new home because we've got way too many carts, too many projects. We've got the Odyssey build coming up. We have a couple mini bikes we picked up that we want to build. So thanks for watching. Thank you, Go Power Sports. Thanks everybody. Thank you guys for subscribing. Thanks for watching. And thanks, Predator. Farewell, Internet Explorer. All right, so I'm gonna end this video real quick.
Thank you. New air. Got that fridge life now. Uh, so, thanks again. Be sure to check it out. I got all the links in the descriptions. So yeah, get yourself a discount and get yourself a nice fridge. How about that?